Hello guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get this character changing device which you may or may have not seen in the trailers for Bone Lab. Now, make sure if you do enjoy this video to leave a like, subscribe and turn on notifications if you don't want to miss a single video and comment if you want to see more of Bone Lab because I'm very happy to do some more because it's an amazing game so let's get into it. So guys, what you want to do is you want to go up these stairs to start with which is just next to this character chain thing so you go up here to the left which is these stairs uh, so you just go up to the top of this and then once you're at the top you'll see this generator on your right um, and somewhere around here on the floor there will be two batteries which you just pick those up you pick those up and you put them in here right like just just like that you just put them in there so then once you've done that you want to come over here and you'll see this this is the crane so to operate it you go up down and then move which you can see it just down there that little box there um, and by the way quickly just before I explain any more you have to go into each one of these buildings at least once and have, have backed out or, or just played played or backed out so you have to have gone, gone into each one once so you'll know when you've done it because you'll see that box um, will have something a little orb looking like this inside of it. Um, well, just one of those, and then it'll be a beam coming out the top. So uh, the reason it's like that is because you have to use the crane to take them and put them there. So those are the things which are in the top. So you just move the crane. So let's say I wanted to do this one. Uh, I got the crane above it, and then I slow it down. <laughs> And then you'll know when you have it because it goes below the cross, uh, the big cross on there. I can't do it because I've already done it, obviously, which you can see here. Um, and then, yeah, once, once you've done that, um, you'll see that that is unlocked, um, which is those big doors. So I'll see you down there now. So, guys, as you can see, we're at the door now, which is to, well, just in front of mods, uh, which will be on the right of the door and park, which is on the left, and just sandboxes over there and the character change thing is there so all you want to do is you just want to go up this door and if you've unlocked it which you should have if you've done the crane bit then you just bang press that button and it will just open up she then can walk through and then you'll see this big red button here which um, I would recommend clicking because you don't have to but you'll see in a minute that it is quite well not important but it makes it easier so yeah so just press that and so then you'll see this big spectator platform there or room or whatever or office or anything like that so if you look to the side which has these crumbled bits of brick you just want to go up to that side you either side will work but the side is just easier so if this is closed just press that once and just wait for it to open because uh, it has to cycle that as well so just press it once and wait um, if it is closed but if not just walk through and then you can just go down here and then walk through here and you're in this room so once you're in here you can see this ladder here which um, you just want to climb up okay so once you are up here what you want to do is just make your way across here to this second fan here simply stop the fan and then crouch down and get through like that and you can just push this open and then shut it as well just like that and then you can chuck down the hammer and just jump over and then you come on here and just press this red button here on the left of the left one um, and then for any reason if this isn't here then you can just press that button to recall it back so um yeah just wait for this to go to the top and then yeah I'll see you at the top so guys as you can see I am currently at the top and then I'm just going to go straight ahead across this platform and then you just want to go straight ahead from the platform and bang through the doors just like that and then try and avoid those boxes because obviously it spawns those things um, so this is where I was confused for a good 30 minutes because I just didn't look around make sure to always check your surroundings for things like the crane so if you just um, so um, so if you just go straight ahead just to the first desk you'll see this which operates the crane so then you just want to go down over here just below um, just below the crane because then it just yeah it goes down here so lift the desk and move out of the way just like that 
and then grab this and swing it across and then you'll see there's a little plug down there, little sink plug so you're just going to want to just lower the crane down um, jump down first so it doesn't sway around when it goes down and then just lower the crane down just like this so then once it's about there uh, well actually well well no just about there or wherever just move this slightly out of the way so as you can see I have now got the crane onto the plug and I'm now just simply gonna press upwards and it is just um, it is just gonna take the plug up like that so you can just now throw down the controller it doesn't matter where it goes and then you can just simply jump down here so guys once you're through to here you just um you just want to come over here grab this ammo and you may or may not have a gun which you probably do by now but um you just yeah you just want to come through here like this okay and just get these guys like like this oh this gun has got like no ammo it's ridiculous so then you just want to get him and then you just want to be careful because yeah there's a guy up there so you want to get him silently and then yeah okay so if you do make any noise he might not be up there he might be just around the corner so just be careful of that <laughs> i just got to make sure I don't drop my gun here uh, okay so then when you once you're here you just want to press this button here and then you just want to press this button which will shoot the ball up wait and it hits that button and then it opens that so you um so you just want to head over here um and then once you're over here yeah so you just go around the back here um and turn on this valve and then go just go around the back I, was, I got lost there <laughs> and then and then just move this uh, just there or wherever So yeah, he yeah, <laughs> um, and then you just want to make your way up here like this. Don't worry if it drops a bit like that. Just carry on, go through here, and then if you don't already have a gun, there is one here. If you don't have one, uh, then you can just grab this ammo like this, and then grab this ammo too, and this ammo too. Cool, right, then you just want to go through these doors, and then, and then just drop down. And then these guys are just annoying. That's what I thought. <laughs> okay, so then, so then, yeah, you just move on to here, this, you don't need this right now. Um, wow, is that three of them up there this time? No, it's just two. I don't know if that's two or three. Oh well. Um, and then you're gonna become Captain America because you're gonna grab this du uh, bin lid and then just walk up here and block all the shots of the sentry turrets. And then <laughs> drop it down here. Why is that guy there? Oh well. Packs itself up like that. And yeah, you can just get this guy. But then I'm pretty sure... Yeah, there's... Oh, jeez, hello. There's a guy there and a guy there. Why has this gun like, got, like, no ammo? Just double-check that no one's down there. And then you can just make your way up here, like this. Um, and then <laughs> just come through here. And then these boxes will just fall. And then it'll be these things, which is very annoying. So you can just get them. Get them. Oh jeez, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> there you go. So then you can just move on to this wall, which you just grab here. 
and pull across. It's like on springs or something. So just you gotta just slide through. My hand is stuck in the wall. Well, in this gate thing. There we go. Cool. And then, yeah. So the guy is gonna decide he's just gonna wait there for me. <laughs> okay, cool. Now you can just get this. Um, I'm gonna swap it for this because I don't really like that gun very much. It's got like no ammo, so. So you move on to here, where you can just take these guys out. What way are these guys just not? There we go, and then take this guy out to There we go. Don't worry too much about that turret because it can't really get you. Uh, which is good and so you can just move along past here and then just rip these off in, or if you have a gun you can just shoot them off but I'm gonna rip them off like this and like this and then punch through them that's quite cool that bit actually <laughs> then you can just drop them here get your gun Twizzle rounds and get these guys. Yeah, okay, they are both definitely gone. Uh, twistle this. There you go. So, um, yeah, we can just go up here like this. And then just jump up here. And then we're going to take this guy out. There we go, cool. Oh, and take this guy out too. Cool. Right, and then, oh yes. Ah yes, so we can just grab this ammo. And grab that ammo too. <coughs> <coughs> and then grab that ammo. And then move on to this over here, grab that ammo. Then grab that ammo, and then we can just move it along over to here. Yeah, so just grab this, and then yeah, there we go. Yeah, so just yeah, move move here, and then yeah, pull this along, and make sure you keep it above your head because if you pull up like this and you're trying to pull it along, it doesn't. Well, it has momentum now, so it's gonna. But you're pulling yourself off the ground, so it doesn't work. So keep it in the air, but not too much so that you're pulling it off like that. But keep it up, and then you can pull it along. And then also you can use this to climb up. So yeah, it's quite cool. And then just move along here, like this. And then yeah, you can just get to the top. And then if it moves along too much like this, you just pull it along like this. Pull it all the way to the edge, because you might end up accidentally pulling it across again. So that's fine and then yeah move along <coughs> like seriously and then we just make our way back up again <laughs> can we put no we can't yes maybe we can can we put it along just a little bit Then just make our way across again. And then, yeah, we got ourselves down a bit and grab onto it. Cool, yep, yeah, right. Pull ourselves up. And then watch out for this guy. And then move up here. Make sure you don't press this button when you're here because it activates this, which then falls down and then. And um, and then we fall down too. Uh, so yeah. Well, I fall down too, and then yeah, you just you just down again. It does reset though, so if you do fall down by accident, no problem. You can go back up. 
And then this you don't need to worry about too much unless you're trying to do the ball thing, but I'll just show you anyway, just in case. So you just grab onto this and pull this up. Uh, let's get it out of the way and then yeah. And then the ball will fall fall down. Like, okay, we nearly fell down too. <laughs> then yeah, it'll fall there and then oh it actually stuck there that time. So yeah, you can just push that off if it does stay there and you want it now. Press that, I guess. And then you saw that laser. Well you may not have, but like yeah, there's there's people here too. So quickly dart behind this cover and then What? And yeah, there's there's more people too, so like you can just do like that. And then you just push push off like that. And then <laughs> take out the other guy. Wow, they're really crammed up in that thing. There we go, get them. Might be some more people, so just yeah. Um, oh yeah, so then once you're here, push this down quickly before it goes back. And then, yeah, you just make your way up here. And then, get these guys too. There we go. Get this guy too. Get this guy too. And then, reload and then, yeah, just carry on. Oh no, he's not there. Check, I don't draw my gun. <laughs> and then you just make your way to the end here. Um, run, 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 run. And once you get to the end, it just finishes. So yeah, once you're here, you just want to go straight forward. And here, if you didn't know about the vehicles already, you can just do about this. You can just look at this. Uh, and it just tells you how to do it. So, yeah. Um, and if not... You can um, you can just come th come through here and uh, hop over here like this, and then come through here, jump over all these railings. There we go. There we go. And then, yeah, we can just go across there, and then bosh around this corner, bosh around this corner. <laughs> And then yeah, just run down here, just like this. And then yeah, we get to the bottom, just go to this back one here, straight away. And you can see this thing coming, which is, no, it's not an enemy. It is just a cart with a little machine gun on the front. Well, pretend one, well, I think. So then yeah, once you're here, you're just standing here, you don't know what to do. Right thumbstick, push it down until you sit down. And then if you're wondering why you're not going, because you need to lower this. So just pull that down, then you go forward. So then, yeah, you'll stop here, and then the car will just go past, and then you, you then just go to, one second, just like this. So then you just sit here, or you can use this to shoot these things. Um, okay, we're going to ignore that, I didn't just miss that. <laughs> uh, get them, or just sit here and wait, um, which is probably what I'm going to do, but yeah, it's, it's up to you, completely up to you. So, yeah. So as you can see, we are in the next one. This one looks a bit creepy, but it's not. You just open the door and you go through. So, you just walk through here. And then we just go to this crate over here. If you don't have a good gun already, which I do, but I'll just show you for the sake of it. And then you get all this ammo and you get those guns. So that's quite cool. So, I'll just reload all my guns. Cool. And then you can just fight these guys. Yeah. So I'll see you once I'm done. So as you can see, we've done that. So you just go to the end. We we just came out over there somewhere. So just come to the end. Not to the, not that red lift. Just come right, and you'll see here we're in this office. Look around for any little orbs. Just grab them, put them apart, and that's good. That's done. Then just pull this off like that, and then go like this. And then drop down here. Shoot through that door, and then there'll be ammo over here. With a shotgun, if you want to take that, that's fine, you can. 
So, yeah, then there is um, quite a few of these guys around here. So, um, uh, I'll just cut the video and I'll see you when I'm done. So, yes, I am done. So, we should walk through it like this. So, I should check I didn't drop my gun. <laughs> and then, yep, just come through here. There will be some ammo over here. So, we can just pick this up. Um, and then walk to the end here, boom, go through these doors, uh, should go up these stairs, you can go down if you want, but I've never been down there, so I don't actually know what's down there. So, um, yeah, just make your way up here, and then, um, once we get to the top, I'll show you what we need to do. Ah, yes, here we go, so get to the top, go through these doors, I'm just going to check this, because I don't know if these open or not, no, they don't. Oh, that'd be cool if they did. Oh well, go through these first doors, like this, get this guy, then around the corner there'll be another one of these guys. So then, wait for the other one, the other one's going to come through in a second. Or not, just grab this ammo here. No, yeah he will, let me jump. Um, okay, right now, um, <laughs> as we come through, you may or may have not seen that there's a key here, so just grab that. And stick it there. Just be careful when you go through. That vent there has a little creature comes out. Yeah. Well, it's just only this little thing. But it made me jump. For the first time, I mean. And there is another one. Yep, there is. Which you can just get easily. Not too difficult. So then, boom! Go through here like a legend. Jump down like James Bond. Get that guy and get this guy too. And if you look here, you can just see this guy here, which this is where you first get this. Not, you can't use this bit, you can't actually use it, but you get it on your arm. So then you just go through here, get the salmon if you want, which I'm gonna because I might need it. And then just walk down here. Get this guy. And as you walk on the corner, be careful because there's a guy there. Always keep your gun on you just in case someone does walk through and like you know peeks around the corner, um, like that. Because if they do that and you're not prepared, probably not likely to win. So, then you're all good, you can just move through, boom, through these doors. Cool, right then, just make your way through, just check out the intro of my gun again. Then to the secret little doorway. Drop down. And then you can go through there and check if there's any of the little orbs, which there is, there is one. Grab it, pull it apart, and then you have it. Then you can just take this ammo here. Bear in mind, guys, you don't have to take the ammo, but um, obviously it would help you out a lot. Um, so, yeah, I'd recommend it. So, then, yeah, there'll be a guy up here too, which is he's just there waiting. So, then you just make your way up here. You're looking at kids. And then, yeah, he will start hey, talking, and that's when you receive you this. This thing, yep. Yeah. This thing right here. Not with all the characters, and not you're not able to use it yet. But you you do just get that, which is quite cool. You make, you can tell you're making progress, which is quite good. So um, yeah, he'll um keep talking, and then um yeah, he'll see lightning, and then that will happen. Um, it will be on your arm, and then yeah, you get pushed into the elevator. So as you can see, we're in the next one. Here we are, Street Puncher. <laughs> so. You'll hear this randomizing, and then in the mirror, you'll change into this guy, which is quite cool. This guy is awesome. He's quite strong, so just is good. So yeah, you can um, move through this door like this, and then just <laughs> get your gun ready, uh, reload it. 
reload all your guns actually. It's probably a good idea, eh? <laughs> and get your gun ready because. Yeah. <laughs> I quite like personally taking out the enemies with this rather than a gun. But obviously, you guys can do whatever you want, it's completely up to you. So. Yeah. I should go through and take all these guys out. There we go. Do you reckon we can use it? This is like a golf club. Oh, nearly. Oh, do I see? Yes! That is a brilliant place to hide. I need to get that. So, this is a great example of what to do for the orbs so you see that and then you just grab it and just pull it apart there we go it will tell you what it is and then you can just carry on playing like that so yeah I knew I saw something down there and it was a little orb which is quite cool and then so you can just move on to over here Make sure they're definitely not going to get up. Oh, goodness me. And attack you again. So then, just move through here. Like this. And then, yeah, move down here like this. There we go. So there we go. Like this. Brilliant. And there we go. Hmm. Oh, this guy's going back for more. And then, okay. Is it done? Hang on. Maybe, yeah, maybe he just, does, just doesn't count or something. There we go. And then, get this guy too. And this, these guys here. Oh. The laser's pointing at me through the wall. There. There we go. Check for any little orbs anywhere. And I don't think there's any here, but we'll just check in case. No, I don't think so. And then let's go up here. Let's go up here and just see if there's any orbs. Let's just go up here. And then... We, and then um, and then obviously we can check if there's actually any orbs up here that we could perhaps collect. Because they're good, you want to collect. Any up here? No, I don't think so. I hate those things, so I'm just gonna run. Oh, four more. You want some too then? Oh, it's the guy, but oh no, it's not, it's just here. It's just here. There you go. You might hear a little noise, I can't remember what it is, but then you'll know that this is open. It just indicates that this is open again now or again or whatever. And then you just go through here. Get this guy too. See them all waiting for you. Yeah, there you go. So you just you've got those guys. Now you can move through to here, which you can then go like this and bang <coughs> like that. And then you can just pick him up and chuck him off there if you really like. <laughs> There's a sledgehammer there if you want to pick that up. Goodness, I just hit something. <laughs> then burst through these doors. 
smash his computers and then get him. There we go. And then you're done. And then here you'll see there'll be the orb for this character. So, as I did just before, you just pick up the orb with two hands and put it apart. And then you're done. So yeah, I'll see you in the next one. So, as you can see, we're in the next one. So then you just walk to this, uh, and you'll have uh, a mirror in front of you. You can hear it randomizing again, and then you turn to this character. So then you can just move through here, and... And then, yeah, you're basically on a parkour level. So you just jump down here, and then run up here like this. And then, you just basically, this one's not too difficult. You just work your way through it, and then... You'll just find out what to do over time. Um, but I'll still do it, I'll still complete it to show you. So you just make your way up here. Oh my goodness. So yeah, once you made your way up these like blocks here, you just go across this beam uh, to here. Where you make your way to this. And then you can walk across this, here like this. Grab that. That, throw it off through here. Grab this if you really like. Oh. And then you see there, no container, but there will be in a second. We're going to make our way across here like this. Good, cool, right. Make over here, over this, over this, and then up here. And then you want to go straight through, grab this box and then put it on here. Put it right to the edge though, because you're gonna get the next one. So, like that. And then, pull this up here, put it on there. Cool, good, there you go, that's on there, and then you'll see the container moves. And then you wanna just make your way up here, like this. And then run and jump. Oh, okay, I messed it up. Cool. Right, make your way up here. Run. Jump across here like this. Grab the edge. And you're up. Oh. Oh, goodness. I did, this was, I did not plan for this to happen. Oh, my. Oh. Okay. I was, like, hanging off the edge. That's great, isn't it? And then just make your way across this bridge. So then we can just jump down here. Cool. Right. Awesome. So then you see that wooden panel there? Fine. Run and jump. Cool. Oh, I made it. Wow, that's awesome. Cool. Run, jump. I would like hold jump. I'm not crouching, by the way. I'm like holding jump and then run. And like you basically just run and jump. So yeah, you get distance, so then you can just make your way across here, you... Oh my goodness, that was close. Oh right, I've gone the wrong way, right, okay. Brilliant. <laughs> cool, okay, so then you make your way up this, here, here, and then across to this, and then you can just jump across here. Cool. And then you jump up here. Jump up here. And then there, you've pretty much done the parkour part. Well, you have, yes. And then press this button. Button. And press this button. And then you start going down there. And then you just go across the. So then you'll have the orb here, which you grab that, and you pull that apart, and that goes to this, which will be the next character, which is this one. So, yeah, um, I'll see you in the next level. So we are in the next one. So if we go across the mirror, you'll start hearing it randomizing, and then you get this guy. This one I think is really cool. So, um, yeah, I think this one's really awesome. It feels like my arms are really far out as well, so it feels like you've got like extended arms. It's really cool. So you just walk out here, and then basically you just go against waves of enemies, which you can just grab and throw. You don't really need to use guns for this, because you can literally just one-punch them all in the head, so. It says that as he picks up a gun. Great. 
cool. Right, there we go. So yeah, we can just run across here. Grab this guy. Bang. Bang. Throw him off. Now, it's very tempting to go after those guys, but just wait until they get closer, because you want to really stay around this to guard it. Okay, well, I missed that, but you know. Um, don't worry, you can leave it a little bit late, it's not too big an issue. Okay, I'm just gonna... There we go. You can literally just punch these guys and it... yeah. Excuse me. I was even polite about it. Yeah, <laughs> I really like this guy. I'm gonna double check he's definitely not gonna stand up and attack it. Cool. So yeah, you just carry on doing this. And these guys you do have to go to though because obviously they shoot fire and they probably won't move. So quick to get back. But this guy's not the quickest guy, so a bit difficult. But um yeah. yeah. Take a gun magazine. Okay. Right, well. He flopped and he died. What okay yeah. So you know you'll you'll know you're done because yeah. Well, this doesn't glow, so then you can just make your way to the end. Um, so once you get over here, you'll see there's another orb. I've already done it, so obviously, you know, I've got all of them. So yeah, you'll have an orb here which you can just grab with two hands and just pull it apart. Goes to that and like yeah, yeah, you just basically goes to that and then yeah, you get it. So yeah, I'll see you in the next one. So see, we're in the next level. So. You walk out here and you realize it's quite slow. You'll see why in a second. Do you randomize? And yeah, you change. So, the reason you're really slow is because it's zero gravity. So yeah. So if you are stuck at all on this one, by any, by any reason, then just look at this map. It will show you where to go, which is straight ahead there. Retrieve mission objective, which is there. So we just have to go basically straight out. So we'll go out like this. So... Yeah, we'll just make our way. If you look to the left, you'll see the spawning gun. Yes, the one that we all want. The the cool new one. So, yeah, you can get that, and then you can put it in your pocket or whatever you want to do. So, yeah. So, it's just the crater, not that thing here, which is the moon and landing thing. I don't know. It's the crater behind it. But I actually find it easier, just a tip, instead of running, crouch right down and, like, basically gorilla tag run. Yeah, so you can just like gorilla tag run over there, um, and then yeah. So yeah, once you you've got to this bit, you want to just go to the top of the crater. Cool, right? <laughs> and then, then you just um, and then you can already see it, actually the very top of that thing. If you can actually see it, and again, it's just easier just to bubble down like this. So then, if we just go around the back of it, just just to um, just around the back of this thing, then um, we'll see the little doorway so yeah I'll see you there in a second so yeah as you can see once we're in the, this bit we can just climb up here so we just want to climb up this bit and then obviously when we get to the top we'll have the orb thing we need to grab so if I can oh okay well we're gonna grab that apparently okay cool right so we're gonna we just grab onto this and then climb up like that there we go then we're trying to get up to the top of there so you can see that little box there um, we can, you know, climb up that. So, yeah, we'll just climb up this. And then, yeah, we can just make our way to the top like this. So then, jump. Oh, okay. Jump like this on top of this. Why is this not working? There we go. Jump onto here like this. 
grab no never mind you can't grab that apparently grab that or you can just jump and go onto this like I just did um, and then you jump onto here jump up here like this okay cool so then you will now have the orb here so you grab it two hands put it apart and it goes to that so that's how you do this one so I'll see you in the next one so guys as you can see we are in the next one and then we're just gonna go through here character randomizer and then as you see we change this one so um, we're gonna go through this here through this gate ah oh, it's so difficult to get through there <laughs> um so so as you can see yeah this is the go-kart one most people will like this one because well the go-kart so if you're not if you're confused how to get into the go-kart right thumbstick just down once and then you get in so um i'm gonna go and do my three laps and then i'll see you when I'm finished. So as you can see I'm in, I've am i done the race so I just need to click down the right joystick and it hops, it jumps, I jump out. So then I'm just gonna, I'm literally just gonna um, just climb to the top of this where the orb will be. So uh, and then um, yeah I'll show you once we're up here. Cool. Yeah it's Woohoo! Yay, I won! <laughs> okay, yeah, so the orb will be here. Grab two hands, just pull it apart, it'll go to this. So, um, I'll just go to the next one and I'll see you there. So, as you can see, we're in the next one. Um, and you step here, the thing randomizes. <laughs> it, it's, it's quite cool, you go gotta admit. It's quite cool. So, yeah, um, it goes to that. So, avoid that, because that does a bit of damage and it messes up your thing and it, like, randomizes your character. So, yeah. Climb up this here like this, and then you jump up here, and then yeah. So um, yeah, you just keep going to the top. It's not too difficult. You just go up here, and then you hit randomizing. Don't jump when it randomizes because you don't know who you're gonna get. You might get someone really slow. Randomizing again. Okay, I'm gonna get this guy who can't jump. Why on earth did I even attempt that? Oh well. Um, yeah. That's just, that's annoying. That is also annoying because I knew he couldn't jump and I tried it. <laughs> oh well, so we'll just go to the top here. Then you might not be stuck on this one, or you might be. So I'm just going to go to the top. And then, okay, cool. Yeah, I can hit randomizing. So it's just tried to, it's, it's tr literally knows that I'm trying to get up here. And it's not, it doesn't want me to. So yeah, there we go. So climb up here, like this, and then you might take a couple, a little bit of damage from those guys. So just try, just try and avoid them, them. Just try and avoid them. So climb up this, like, like this, and then you can climb up here. And then make sure you grab the sword because this is gonna really, really gonna help you. Otherwise, you cannot complete this level basically. So keep hold of this. Um, also, you can get those guys with them, and they're very annoying because they do quite a fair bit of damage, and they are just annoying, really. So I'm going to grab this, swing myself here, and climb up like this. And then I'm going to, hopefully, I'm going to try and get onto here. Okay, it's going to make me this guy. Right, so I'm gonna just untangle the sword, and it's crazy how much smaller this guy is than the other big guy. Honestly, oh, jeez, didn't know I could do that. I was just trying. It's quite cool. Just trying to push this down. So, so then I'm going to change the big guy. You might be him already, but I just I'm just gonna do this. I know. You won't be able to do that yet, but I'm just going to do this for now. Oh, that's annoying. Usually I can get in. There you go. You just get in with the sword, and then... Cool, yeah, there you go. So it will... The orb will... You can just chuck this away now. 
Um, yeah, okay, yeah. So the orb will just be there. You grab it with two hands, pull it apart, and this guy will go to this. So um, I'll hit go, and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, so, okay, yeah, so cool. Uh, I'll just change back to my character. So yeah, you're in this this next one, and then you can just, yeah, you go to the Oh, and by the way, when you open the orb and you put it apart, if you didn't know already, you probably do by now, but it just, it will automatically take you to the next one. So yeah, he talks, there, lightning comes off it, and now it is working. So now, you can now grab it and move it and change character. So it shows you how to, so you just pull it, like change to any character. So, just showing you, for example, all of these guys. You know, the ones we've just done, any of these, really. Um, so, yeah. So then, yeah, he talks you a bit more, gives you this key. Just grab it and um, hold on to it, for sure. Okay, so as you can see, we're in the next one. So, yeah, the key will be in front of you, so just grab that and um, hold on to it, for sure. Because this is the last step. And, by the way, guys, now you can change wherever, your character. So, yeah, so you just go back up to the top where the crane was very, very, very start. Just climb up here. Well, not climb, you just run up here, these steps. <laughs> uh, and then, when you are holding the key, you put it there. You put it into this. It will show you, and you just pop it there. And then it unlocks it. You may be wondering, what is it? That is what it is. So if you just walk over here... Um, I'm not going to spoil this. I'm not going to spoil this for you guys, but I'll just look inside. So you can just, like in a trailer, look through, and you can see. Now, now, now you put the key in. You press that big red button. I'm not going to do it because I don't want to spoil it for you guys. But once you do it, you'll see the magic happen. It's so cool, and I love it. And then you're done. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn notifications on if you don't want to miss a video, and comment if you want to see more of Bone Lab, because I think it's an amazing game, so I'm happy to bring in more. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.